<laughs> it does sound like you're uh, quite busy with uh, between teaching and uh, working in the surgery in the hospital and then the clinic time as well. Yeah. So what day is it and where am I? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm going to hop over here to another question from Aiden. And uh, they're asking, they recently started shadowing a podiatrist and they know it varies state to state, but what's the average salary for a DPM, if that's something that you know? Um, yeah, I, not trying to be vague on purpose, but gosh, this is so incredibly variable. Um, and it, it's probably less variable from state to state and more variable in the position that you take as a podiatrist. Um, so I think that for the majority of working uh, podiatrists, our salaries are in some way, um, you know, compensation based, based upon production. Um, and that may be based upon revenue that we bring into a practice, or they, that may be um, RVU based, based upon the types of procedures that we're performing or how often we're operating, the volume that we're seeing if we're hospital employed. Um, you know, and so I, I think that it's a, you know, it's a, it's a fair salary. It probably, you know, is, is somewhere in the range of anywhere from, you know, 100 to 300,000 a year, um, depending on how much you're doing, what you're doing. Um, and again, somebody who is employed by a big health system in a big hospital, um, you know, who may be in a, in a more remote or rural location, uh, may be looking at, you know, $250,000 a year, somebody who's in private practice, um, you know, who is really sort of hustling as far as patient care goes may see a year where it's, you know, 75, 80,000 and may see a year where it's 350,000. Um, and so that that really, really varies depending on what you're doing. Um, and I see a ton of pluses and minuses as to being hospital employed, um, a ton of benefit as to being private practice employed. It just really has to fit, you know, lifestyle and what you're going for. Thank you. That's a real detailed answer, uh, breaking down what the different uh, things that factor into what the salaries are. Uh, we have a question here from Paul. If you enjoyed this, click the thumbnail to watch the full video or visit Student Doctor Network to see the free resources we have available to help you become a doctor.